everybody. How y'all doing today? Whew, thank y'all for joining me. So do y'all see what we're going to do today? Let's say prayers and I'll tell y'all. Oh, Father God, I just want to say thank you. Thank you for blessings, mercy, grace, sovereignty, and love. Thank you, Father. Let this food be nourishment to my beautiful and healthy body. In the name of Jesus, I pray. Amen and amen. We have Chick-fil-A. You, you remember I said I did the Jack in the Box spicy sandwich? Last week I did the um, Popeye's spicy sandwich. And then now I have the deluxe spicy sandwich, waffle fries, and the macaroni that every macaroni and cheese that everybody says is good. I wanted to try it, y'all. So um, let me dig in. And uh, let me dig in and we will see. So let's toast to all my hustlers, my news, and my new ones too. I um <laughs> I have some new subscribers, and yeah, thank you, God, for building up my page. I've prayed and prayed, and I'm still praying, yeah. So, salute, salute. Let's sip, sip the good stuff. Mm -hmm. Let's taste this, uh, this macaroni. Well, let me give y'all the first bite. Take the first bite. It's a good job. Because I'm about to put it in my mouth. Mm -hmm. Let's see. Mm. Mm. Well, it's creamy. I'm so glad it's still hot. It's good. Mm-hmm. Okay. It's good. I have some uh, honey mustard for my fries. And even dip my sandwich in it. How about that? Y'all, I tell y'all, my channel is growing and I I love it. I I have uh acquired some more new subscribers and I know it's God and yeah that's why I always thank him for everything because without him we don't have anything here take a bite mm -hmm. okay I don't know about the waffle fries. They are, uh, they soft. They ain't crunchy. I don't know about that. Oh, Lord, and they covered with salt. Oh, my God. Oh. Mm. It's good with the dipping salt. What's the plan, y'all? For the weekend. But of the plans, I don't have none. I got a call yesterday from somebody I met two months ago, three months ago. And um, he want to hang out. So we'll see. All right, y'all. Take a bite of this sandwich because this is my first time. Let's see what, if I know what, because I didn't know what the height was with Popeye's sandwich, so. This is the last one, y'all. Let's see. Good bite. Mm-hmm. Immediately. I taste the spice. I didn't taste that spice with Popeye's until I got to the middle 
of the sandwich with that mayonnaise. Mm. This one is spicy. It, mu it has to be in the chicken, y'all, because I see red in that chicken. And I got some pepper jack cheese on here, too. I taste that spice right away. I don't see nothing on, on the bread on that side. Ain't no mayonnaise or nothing. What is that? I don't see nothing now. And ain't nothing on this side either. So, yeah, okay, it's a dry sandwich. But, but the bread is dry. The chicken is juicy and it is really spicy. Mm -hmm. It's good. And spicy. This macaroni and cheese is good. <laughs> mm -hmm. It really is good. Mm -hmm. Ooh. Mm. Yeah, that's pretty good. Okay. Mm-hmm. I'll tell y'all which one I like the, the best at the end. I think y'all know. <laughs> this is a good sandwich. It really is. Jack in the Box sandwich was okay. Popeye's sandwich got better in the middle with the mayonnaise. But I didn't see what the hype was about for Popeye's. But this deluxe. Spicy? Yeah. It hits you right away. Right away. This is macaroni and cheese, y'all. I can order a pan of this for, for, for a Sunday meal. Mm hmm Do they sell it? <laughs> I told my son I was going to be doing a mukbang with uh, Chick-fil-A macaroni and cheese and sandwich. And he said, Mama, they said that, I, I never saw the commercial. He said, they say it's better than your grandma's. He said, I don't believe that. I'm going to have to tell him. It's neck to neck. <laughs> it really is neck to neck, y'all. It's good. I'm very well pleased. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Yep. Chick fil A one. <laughs> Chick fil A one. I'm not big on these waffle fries, though, y'all. They could have kept these. Mm -mm. I won't get these again. Mm -mm. They didn't make a hit with me. My head is cut off, ain't it? Just a little bit. Ooh. I'm so glad it's Friday. I am so glad it's Friday. Okay. Let me eat just a little bit more. We're going to... Tell some more of the story that I, I, I told yesterday about when I first met my husband. I hope I didn't do this twice, y'all. I kind of feel like I already talked about him before. But I don't know if it was in detail. I do believe I mentioned him. Mm -hmm.
I would definitely get that sandwich again and again and again and again and again. Mm -hmm. I don't know what the original tastes like, but the deluxe, I have to say it's pretty good. <laughs> I'm very well pleased. Mm -hmm. Y'all, I think I've had chick filet once in my life. Mm -mm. Twice. And I think I had these waffle fries that I gave away. I don't know why I got them this time. They need to be fried hard. Look at this salt. Some of the ends are hard. In the middle, it's just like... Oh, mm -hmm. It's soft. Mm -mm. They can keep that. Mm. I'm very pleased with this mac, y'all. Mm. I'm very pleased. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm. That's good. That is so good. Mm -hmm. I'm getting full. Mm. I had a doctor's appointment today. I was getting some pains and I had to do some x-rays today. So I know it's in God's hands. But, you know, when you look at the, the uh, x-ray petition, and he was just so bubbly, and his personality was so good, but he kept wanting to do more and more x-rays to the, this side, this side, he's saying, then when I saw him looking, he just got so quiet, y'all. He didn't say nothing else to me while he was studying them x-rays. Maybe that's a part of his practice. I don't know to make you comfortable. So just pray for my help, y'all. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Y'all. I just want to do a shout out right now to the people that I watch every single day. Dane Dash, Stephen Tosh, Easy and Natalie. Now, you know what? I can't get enough of them. They, those pranks, <laughs> they are, oh my God. Eating pretty. Her storytelling is really good. She tells it really well. She does. I'm going to start writing down names, y'all, because I don't remember all these people I watch. Be love, for co of course. She about to get her book written. You know, how to, uh, you know, be successful on YouTube or whatever you're doing and you're hustling for. She, she's about to get her book ready. Yeah. Beast mode and his cute wife. I don't know why I keep forgetting her name, y'all. I keep forgetting it. You know what? I'm going to do this again, but I'm going to have to jot down all the names because there's a lot of them. Oh, it's Kim B. 
Oh, KC, KC Connection. Her too. I like her laugh. <laughs> It's a lot of others. I just want y'all to know I support y'all every single day. Period. If I miss some, I don't, I don't, I don't get off YouTube until I see all of them. And today, y'all, I learned how to look at the mukbangas on my TV, my big old TV. Now I don't have to just look at that computer and, and continue to squint my eyes when, when they get tired. It's going to be on the big TV, y'all. All right. I think I've had enough of eating. Let's get back to the story of yesterday with my uh, journey of my husband before we got married. So I think I stopped at. Mm. He was the perfect gentleman. Perfect. And even when I did that romantic dinner, <laughs> nothing happened. And that's when I was thinking, is something wrong with that tattywhacker? Or is he really, or he don't know how to do the do? Or is he really a gentleman? Well, I want to say a week later, maybe, because I don't know what my kiss felt to him, but his kiss was on point on that on our dad's romantic date, and I thought we was going to do the nasty, but he only kissed me, and that was the first time he kissed me as well. Baby, that first kiss, I don't know what he was feeling. I knew how I felt, but his feeling had to be intact with mine because, my God, that was the longest ass kiss I ever had. I'm trying to breathe through it. You know, how you going to breathe with your tongue down somebody's throat? It was hard. <clears throat> but I did it, obviously. Ooh, now you know, now you already know, I can't even, I can't even tell y'all that that kiss made every, mm -hmm, everything just pulsate. <laughs> But it wasn't until the next week. Mm -hmm. But keep in mind, we kept courting. We kept talking every day. Sometimes we used to uh, go to sleep on the phone, y'all. You know, I forgot I had to get up and go to work the next morning, and so did he, honey. We was on that phone like high school children. And then that weekend came. He asked if he could spend the first weekend with me without going home. I'm like, um, hell yeah. I wanted to find out if everything that I was feeling every time he touched me when he looked at me, if it was real. Huh. I need to find that one out. Honey. On that Friday night, after, you know, we danced a you know, little bit in the living room, we listened to uh, some smooth jazz, and we listened to some of um, that old school two-step and slow dance and music, and we danced, and, you know, like I said, he wasn't that drinker, but I was sipping, sipping on some something, something, sip, sip, sip that good stuff. Mm-hmm. We took our shower together the first time. Actually, it wasn't a shower. We ran bubble bath that night. Oh, sexy. Woo! Just sexy. And that was the first night that our bodies encountered one, uh, encountered one another. It was like magic. It was sweet. It was sensual. It was hard, it was soft, it was everything that you can think of. 
It was electrifying. I'm going to leave that right there. <laughs> The morning after. Was just the same. <laughs> we laid in the bed for half the day. Just curled up. You couldn't put a stick pin between us, honey. We were so close together. We got up. We prepared to start the next day. We didn't do much. Um... He was, uh, uh, that's when I learned also that he was a chef. He cooked this marvelous meal. We never put no too many clothes on, y'all, that day. <laughs> it was some sleep, some sex, and some food. For the entire weekend. It was time for him to go. Neither one of us wanted it to happen. Not neither one of us. When you allow, okay, so I'm gonna finish this, y'all. Well, I'm a fit. Not, I'm not. I mean, my story is not finished, but I'm I'm getting ready to. My time is winding down. So you know, at the end, y'all already y'all already know I got to get a little serious, right? When you get into new relationships, it's easy. When the sex is good. You know what I mean? You don't see all the red flags. And I'll... I think I dropped something. On my shirt. Ooh. I did, y'all. It's on the floor. We'll get it when I'm done. Whew. When that sex is electrifying like that. You look over all the other flaws. <laughs> you don't learn. I had something in my mouth, y'all. And you don't learn what you need to learn because all you can think about is the, the good time you had and that sex, sex complicate. Mm, I spit. Sex complicates when it's good. Ooh, oh, I was going to say it's a song, God, but I can't sing it because they'll copyright me. Dorn. Dorn. I got caught up. His sex was like a drug to me. I had to have it constantly, constantly. Yeah. So as I get further into this story, this hood, hood girl story, mm -hmm, y'all going to see. Y'all going to see what I just said. So I think today, I don't have sex at all <laughs> like, like I did when, you know, when you're young. Because number one, I'm afraid because there's so many diseases out here now. And not that you have to do it unprotected, but shoot, you just scared. And you have to do these extensive backgrounds to make sure that the man you ain't waking up with in the morning gonna slice your damn throat. Hmm. So I'm very careful. I tell you, I'm very careful who I allow in my private space. You don't, you don't get to just come here and chill with the hood girl. Hood girl, I'm a lot of fun, y'all. I love to dance. I love to sing off tune. I love to just have fun. I love to laugh. I love to crack jokes. I love to play. I love my, my circle to be happy because I choose happy every day. I'm telling y'all, uh, my life is good. My life that I had has created this life that I have. Ooh! What did I just say? The life I had created the life that I have. Glory be to God, honey, because I'm still here. 
Glory be to God that I have this smile and I smile every day. Thank you for the glory of God that I can uh, encourage people. Honey, yes. Mm -hmm. Let me end now because this, this time is steady passing, y'all. I get so passionate about the things that I believe in. Whew. So have a great, great weekend. A good Friday night. Yeah. Or Saturday night. Yeah. Sunday down. Sunday is time to calm it down. Uh, but I'll see y'all before then. Okay. All of my new, all of my new hustlers, hear me and hear me clear. Thank y'all for subscribing to my page. Yes. And everybody else after you guys, if y'all just looking before you leave, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. I would be so happy for y'all to join this hood family. Yes. Don't forget to hit that notification bell because every time I do these videos, you're going to be notified. Don't forget to give me thumbs up if you like my videos. Don't forget to comment, share, and like. Come on back to your hood, girl.